Jackie and today I'm here with a Becca inspired makeup tutorial from the movie Pitch Perfect. I have been so totally obsessed with that movie. You guys don't even understand. I think I've seen it about six times already. In the movie, Becca has this really dark kind of grunge type of look um, and I wanted to recreate it for you guys but instead of like piling on 10 pounds of makeup to achieve the exact same look. I wanted to create the same look but in such an easy and effortless way that you girls at home could recreate this look. So this tutorial is dedicated to my sister but I also did get a few requests from you guys so thank you for your requests. I hope you guys enjoy this look and like I said it is so easy and effortless so I hope that you guys recreate this look and yeah. So oh I didn't even mention my crazy looking hair. This is my hair. This is my hairdo today. So since I was doing something edgy on my face, I kind of wanted to do something a little edgy with my hair. Um, very much inspired by, um, what's her name? I, I honestly don't even know her name, but she's the one that sings, This time baby, I'll be bulletproof. You know, you know that song. So, um, that's kind of my inspiration. I feel like a mixture of Elvis and Bruno Mars right now. I don't know if this is even cool or not. I hope it's cool. If this is not cool, then this is going to be embarrassing. Awkward. Aka awkward. Okay, I'm going to stop talking now and we're just going to get started with the tutorial. So I already did my foundation and my eyebrows because I wanted this to be a really realistic tutorial for you girls at home that wanted to do this. Um, for like school or something like wake up and quickly do this look so um, if your everyday routine doesn't include foundation or, or doing your eyebrows you can skip this completely just do what you normally do and then we'll go ahead and get started on the eyes so I have these two quads from elf and this one is called butternut and this one is called drama and these are only a dollar each so you can get both for just you know two dollars and then you have a bunch of colors that you can work with so from the butternut quad I'm gonna take this brown right here and we're just gonna pop this right in the crease really quickly okay you want it to look more like this I put way too much on this side blending so if you do a mistake like that just keep blending and then everything will be all good so now from the drama quad I'm going to take this black color right here and it's just a matte black eyeshadow and I'm gonna place this all over the lid and just stopping right at the crease on the lid I just quickly apply that nothing too fancy I'm going to take a little bit of the same black on the tip of the brush and then we're just going to drag this onto the lower lash line so then I'm going to go back with that blending brush that we first used and then I'm going to blend out the crease area and just make that black more faded so it's not so harsh and messy so just blend that together so now it's time to line our eyes with eyeliner so just take any black pencil eyeliner and you want to line your waterline and in the pictures that I have of Becca it doesn't look like she has um, any eyeliner on the top but um, if you want you can tight line and what that is it's just if you like lift up it's that little gap right there the little space it's like your waterline but on the top so you can line that if you want now it's time to curl your lashes and if you don't have time in the morning to do this you can just skip the curling of the eyelashes and just move straight to mascara and the mascara I'm using is the Maybelline Colossal the Colossal Volume Express Cat Eyes Waterproof Mascara what a mouthful 
and I'm just going to apply a few coats. Nothing like my everyday mascara routine. Just a little bit of mascara so that the eyelashes are at least defined, you know what I mean? And now the eyes are complete, so you can see how quick and easy this really is. So for the cheeks, I'm going to use ELF's Candid Coral Blush. Looks like this. And I'm going to take this bigger fluffy brush. And when you use a brush this big and fluffy, it's going to make the color a lot more faded and blended. So it's not going to be as harsh. So we're just going to add a very slight wash to the cheeks. All right. So lastly, for the lips, I am using the NYC 2-in-1 Lip Color in Penthouse Plums. And I'm, it has a dark side and a light side, and I'm going to use the light side for this look. So I just quickly applied that onto my lips, and I didn't even apply it perfectly, because now we're going to take our finger and blend it into our lips and this also gives it a softer more natural look so it looks kind of like a stain on our lips so that's it for today's makeup tutorial I hope you guys enjoyed as you can tell it was a super easy fast and effortless makeup look to do and that's why I think this is perfect for those of you who want to try to experiment and play with makeup but you're not like the super girly glamorous type you're more of like the tough edgy rocker chic tomboyish type, you know, something along those lines. I think this would be perfect. It's really easy to do. It gives you an edge and um, yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Please tweet me, Instagram me, or Facebook me a picture if you recreate this look. So I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Have a magical day.